so guys um today we will be studying the like hussein histology and it's chapter number 11 that is the nervous tissue the, this is the lecture first of the chapter 11 uh, that is the nervous tissue so by starting uh, you should know that the um, the nervous system of a human body is made up of the two types of the tissues number first is the nervous tissue and number second is the connective tissue the nervous tissue uh, forms almost almost all of the nervous system of human body but, uh, but the uh, connective tissue forms very less of the nervous system of the uh, human body but it forms some structures in the uh, nervous system of the human body uh, that we can not uh, neglect so in this chapter we are mainly concerned with the nervous tissue and we are not concerned with the connective tissue it forms a very small part of the uh, nervous system of the human body uh, by proceeding forward uh, we should know that the uh, that the uh, nervous tissue of a human body is mainly made up of the two types of the cells number first is the nerve cells uh, number first is the neurons or nerve cells and number second is the neuroglial or glial cells the neurons or the nerve cells are the then the neurons or the nerve cells are the structural and functional units of the of the nervous system but the uh, neuroglial or glial cells are actually the supporting cells of the nervous system are the supporting cells of the nervous system the neurons or the nerve cells are the structural and functional units of the nervous system uh, and the neuroglial or glial cells are the supporting cells of the uh, nervous system they protects nourishes and and maintains the and maintains the neurons or nerve cells so the supporting cells or the uh, neuroglial or glial cells they protect nourishes and maintains the neurons or the nerve cells these kind of cells protects and supports the neurons or the nerve cells the neurons or uh, nerve cells have a uh, have qualities of have three main qualities uh, that is the number first is the excitability excitability second is the conductivity and number third is the ability to secrete neuro neurotransmitters the neurons or nerve cells have three qualities that is the excitability conductivity and number third is the ability to secrete neurotransmitters while the neuroglial or glial cells do not possess do not possess do not possess these these three qualities they only supports the nerve cells or the uh, neurons now proceeding forward uh, uh, we are going going to study that the uh, that the neuroglial or glial cells consist up of the six types of cells the neuroglial or glial cells consist up of the six types of cells so uh, the neuroglial or the glial cell cells consist up of the six types of the cells number first is the astrocytes number second is the oligodendrocytes number third is the microglial cells number fourth, fourth is the ependymal cells number fifth is the schwann cells and number six is the satellite cells the astrocytes oligodendrocytes the microglial cells and the ependymal cells these four types of cells are present in the central nervous system and the two types of cells that are the Schwann cells and the satellite cells they are present in the peripheral nervous system 
So the nerve, the neuroglial or the glial cells are the supporting cells that supports the neurons or the nerve cells and the, uh, it consists of up to six types. The first four types are present in the central nervous system and the last two types are only present in the peripheral nervous system of a human body. So by doing a quick recap, uh, we will be uh, explaining that the, that the nervous system of a human body is made up of the two types of the tissues. Number first is the nervous tissue and the number second is the connective tissue. The, the nervous tissue makes almost all of the nervous system but the connective tissue makes very less of the nervous system. It uh, only forms some, some specific structures, small specific structures in the uh, nervous system of a human body. Uh, the nervous tissue of human body consists of the two types of cells. It is made of the two types of cells. Number first is the neurons or the nerve cells and number uh, second is the neuroglial or the glial cells. The neurons or the nerve cells are the structural and functional units of the nervous system but the neuroglial or glial cells are the supporting cells of the nervous system that protects, nourishes and maintains the uh, neurons or the nerve cells. The neurons or the nerve cells have the qualities of excitability, conductivity and ability to secrete neurotransmitters but the neuroglial or glial cells are only the supporting cells and do, they do not possess such four qualities. The neuroglial or the glial cells now consist of the six types. Number first is the astrocytes, oligodendrocytes, microglial cells, ependymal cells, Schwann cells and the satellite cells. The first four types are present in the central nervous system and the last two types are present only in the peripheral nervous system of a human body.